So, we don't need a long stride. All we need is a short and quick, powerful stride. I sense the strong force in you. Welcome, Kenkichi Mana ones. In this video, I'm going to share the tips for Debana Man. Debana Man is a skill to strike a man as soon as your opponent starts an attack. To succeed, we need precise posture and timing. Let's break it down. Technically, proper posture for Debana Man is different from normal men or the stealth men. The Man is a short range attack because the opponent comes in. So, we don't need a long stride. All we need is a short and quick, powerful stride. As a key point is to reduce the contact time between my Shinai and a shitting point, its stride becomes very short. Watch the right foot and how short the left foot moves. Like rope jumping, it seems like both feet jump forward together. It is almost like hitting in place, but very slight moving forward is needed. It helps to quickly drop the knee to lower your posture. It adds stability in hitting movement as long as it is not overdone. It is more important to strike fast than to strike further. So, the way of swimming Shinai is also a bit different. Don't forget to express dancing. Now, let's look into the important part, the timing. The Man is a counter-attack, so we need to pull in an attack first. It helps to hit at the right timing. For pulling an attack, we need pressure. We should show our intention to hit man, but keep a little bit far distance. It's like, I'm going to hit your man, so you should hit me first if you don't want to lose. If you show the intention from too far distance, your opponent won't do anything. If the distance is too close, you will be hit as soon as you show something. If you keep the right distance, even exaggerated action can be useful. Now, let's practice again while keeping those posture and timing. The process becomes shorter when you have a solid goal. Keep this in mind and practice wisely until the force leads us to meet all together. May Kendo be with you. <laughs> 